Governor Phil Bryant first backed Ted Cruz for president, then Donald Trump. He spent the weekend campaigning for the GOP nominee in Florida and Pennsylvania. I think you're going to see a huge turnout, uh, even though there haven't, hasn't been that much activity here. Uh, Donald Trump's been here on three occasions, but uh, they understand it's important for every vote uh, and that every vote will count. Former Democratic Governor Ronnie Musgrove is backing Hillary Clinton and criticizing Trump for comments regarding women. There would be those that would argue this is the new norm in, in politics. I sure hope they're wrong. I hope that we can get back to a more sensible uh, discussion. Musgrove predicts a Clinton win. Bryant says Trump can win despite the polls if voter turnout for the GOP is better than four years ago. Our uh, concern just now is, is that people who have that opportunity to vote go and do so. We believe if the people who support Donald Trump, and I'm a supporter, if those evangelicals, 25 million of them that didn't get out last year, will get out this election or last election, will get out this election, uh, we'll be victorious. But Musgrove says Trump's rhetoric has drawn a stark divide between himself and Clinton. Musgrove admits the Clinton email scandal may have cost her votes, but in the end, voters should decide based on who has the best plan for the nation. And to me, I think that, that Hillary Clinton, with her uh, w desire to invest in education, looking at job creation, I believe that, that she offers a better plan and a better idea. It is worth noting that this state has gone Republican in every presidential election dating back to 1980. But as we all have noticed, this election has been like no other. At the state capitol, Scott Simmons, 16 WAPT News.